Welcome to GC Ready Technologies. Automation testing job responsibilities. See, in this uh, video, I planned uh, nearly seven topics. First one, ways of software testing. Next, uh, what is automation testing? Types of automation testing. Automated functional testing. Automated performance testing. Automated web services. Uh, API web services testing. All APIs are web services, but not vice versa. API is superior. Okay. Automated API or web services testing. Next, automated mobile testing. See, first, ways of software testing. Software testing. Manual testing. Automation testing. Three terms. These three are not equal, related. Which one is superior? Software testing. Software testing can be done in two ways. One is manual testing. Another is automation testing. Manual testing is one of the ways of software testing. Automation testing also one of the ways of software testing. Okay. Ways of software testing. Next. What is automation testing? Before that, what is manual testing? Testing computer software manually without using any test tool or test script is called manual testing. What is automation testing? Testing computer software using any test tool or test script is called automation testing. Next, types of Automation testing. Say, we have different types of automation testing. Not single type of automation testing. Uh, one is functional automated testing. Automated functional testing. Automated performance testing. Automated API web services testing. Automated mobile testing, etc. See, in these are uh, test types, automated testing types. Functional testing is having nearly 65% market share. Remaining all are 35%, below 35% only. See, first to focus more on automated functional testing. Uh, okay, automated functional testing. Automated functional testing. Say, for conducting automated functional testing, we have several test tools available in the market. Uh, some tools are commercial tools. For example, Smart Beer, Test Complete, uh, Micro Focus, UFT, Unified Functional Testing, formerly Quick Test Professional, QTP, IBM RFT, Silk Test, etc. Next, uh, open source test tools, Selenium, Water, etc. See, in these tools, famous tools are Selenium, Test Complete and UFT. In all these tools, number one tool is Selenium. See, I am, I am going to explain this topic using Selenium point of view. Okay. Select uh, first uh, for any using any test tool for automated functional testing. First, select manual test cases for automation. See, hundred percent automation testing is impractical. Generally, we try to automate maximum test cases. Hundred percent test automation is impractical. Next, generally uh, in software companies, uh, they prefer first cycle of execution, manual testing. Second cycle onwards, regression cycles, automation testing. Okay. Select manual test cases for automation testing. Next, select test tool for automation functional testing. Already I told, we selected Selenium. Okay, Selenium is not a single tool, suit of tools. Select Selenium uh, 
components and other software for testing. Selenium is not an all-inclusive test tool like commercial tools, UFT, RFT, uh, test complete, etc. If it is UFT or RFT or test complete, uh, just install the tool and you can start you can start working with with those tools. But Selenium is not like that. Selenium is not a complete test tool. Uh, it, 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 it is not it is not all inclusive test tool. It requires some third party frameworks and plugins in order to broaden the scope of testing. Okay, so select Selenium components and other software for test environment. Example, Eclipse IDE as editor, Selenium WebDriver as a test tool, Java as programming language, TestNG as testing framework, Maven build automation tool, Jenkins continuous, integ uh, continuous integration, etc. Okay, next, select automation framework and implement it. Say in nowadays automation framework is not uh, not not a feature of test tool. It is third party, but best practice. It is optional, but best practice. Select automation framework and implement. For example, automation framework names also local, keyboard driven framework, data driven framework, uh, hybrid framework, uh, combination of two or more approaches. You select uh, your uh, company automation framework and implement. Next, Selenium test environment setup. Already I told Selenium is not an all-inclusive test tool. It requires some third-party plugins and frameworks in order to broaden the scope of testing. So, uh, first configure Selenium test environment. Next, inspect web or HTML elements. Selenium supports web application testing so uh, you need to inspect web elements or objects like buttons images links radio button check box drop down box combo box uh, check box etc inspect web or html elements or objects element object synonyms next Create test cases using element locators and Selenium WebDriver commands. Next, see functional test tools are object based or element based test tools. Based on front end objects or elements, they perform test operations. For example, click Gmail link in Google home page. Suppose this is one test step. Here, click Gmail link. Gmail link is element in this scenario, element or object. Next, click is the action on the element. For locating that element, element locator is required. Uh, first, Selenium has to identify that element and perform action on the element. For identifying that element by Selenium, we need to use element locator. Next, for performing actions, we need to use Selenium WebDriver methods or commands. See, using web or HTML element locators and Selenium WebDriver commands, Selenium can locate elements in our web pages and perform actions on elements. Next, uh, enhancing test cases using Java programming or using any other supporting language. We selected Java for Selenium. So use Java programming concepts for enhancing test cases. What are enhancements? See, after creating basic test steps using element locators and WebDriver API commands, Next, enhancing test cases. Suppose using Java programming, using Java data types and variables, we can handle different types of data in our test cases. 
using java operators we can perform mathematical comparison and logical operations in our test cases using java methods you can create reusable functions for our test cases using java uh, loop statements we can con- we can conduct data driven testing in selenium data driven testing with selenium next using uh, exception handling code java programming using java exception handling code you can handle run time errors in your test cases so enhance test cases using java programming concepts next create test batches uh next batch testing means executing test batches and generate test reports using test ng see selenium doesn't have built in features it doesn't have built in result report facility using test ng accept commands you can insert verification points and generate test reports see once again create test batches execute test batches and generate test reports using test ng testing framework by integrating test ng with selenium you can achieve it next analyze the test result and report effects it is tester activity it is not selenium's activity or test tool activity analyze the test results and reporting defects uh, and report defects next re and regression testing or you can say change related testing on modified builds next uh, organizing and maintaining automation resources for future okay this is about this is a brief introduction about automation testing automated functional testing next second primary area automated performance testing see using uh, j meter or load runner tools any one tool using j meter or uh, load runner or qa web load or silk performer or ibm rpt rational performance tester etc tools you can conduct performance testing already i told functional test tools are object based test tools based on front end objects they perform test operations performance test tools are protocol based test tools uh, protocols http https jdbc odbc etc based on protocols they perform test operations next in automated functional testing sorry automated performance testing what are the important tasks identifying industry performance testing benchmarks next consider customer interests customer business and create performance test strategy next select test scenarios for load stress spike and endurance testing say load testing stress testing spike testing and endurance testing all these are subsets of performance testing as part of performance testing we conduct these load testing stress testing spike testing and endurance testing okay next prepare performance test plan next generate test scripts uh, using any automation tool like load runner or j meter or rpt or silk performer qa web load or neo load etc uh, generally manual testing is impractical for performance testing automation testing only possible for automated functional testing both manual testing and automation testing possible both are possible but for performance testing manual testing is 